Let's get to the phones, eh? Let's, let's get to business. Q's up next. Q's up. How you feeling, Q? <laughs> oh, man. I, I feel like man, man, man in it right now, <laughs> man. It's, it's bad, man. It, you know, I said it a month ago. I, I got on Fizz, and I was like, look, I'm going to look at everything he does. And there's, two, there's three things that bother me, but there's two things I got to say about Fizz. Number one, there's no accountability for Boom. these players. Boom. You know, you watch you watch there. Think about it. You saw Mitch. Mitch played all game. He played hard all game. Mm. Um, DSJ, he acts like he's good. You know, he yeah. plays lazy. He moves down the court. You saw that dunk he, he attempted? That was the, that was the most pathetic thing I've ever seen, dunk. man. He did, man. Oh he tried to wrap God, his arm around Plumlee. He took off from the foul line, J. Ellis. <laughs> Rap, yeah. Wraps his left arm but around Plumlee. He didn't Plumlee. even go hard, though. Right. Yeah. He didn't yeah. even go hard. He was When you dunk like that, you're supposed to destroy the rim. He yeah. went like a finesse dunk. And... It's to the point where I realize there's really not you could blame you know one there's so many people to blame yeah yeah but the huge part of this is really Fizz because if you look at it he doesn't hold anybody accountable these kids are playing like they they just out there and this defense of switching every five seconds yeah, it's man, ridiculous it's killing us, it's killing us and, I've never, I've never seen a defense. This ain't the '90s where you like, oh, we gotta protect the paint. This is the NBA now. Everybody shoots threes. Yeah. And if there's been plays. I know y'all saw it through the game. You can see two or three guys run into the paint, and I'm like, no, run yeah. to the three point yeah. line. Yeah. Get him off the line. Yeah. Yeah. It, and it's, it's, it's so, and that is coaching. At the end of the day, hey, you I heard you heard Monte Morris said coach. that was their game plan. That was their game plan. Be ready to bomb away from three because they knew the Knicks were going to crowd the paint. Yep, and they have slow. Routine. I can't. I can't give. I can't give Fizz no leeway no more. Yeah. It is your game plan to. And then the second half. They came out, did the same thing. First play no of the third it. quarter by the yeah, Nuggets. Man. First play of the third quarter by the Nuggets was a three, wide open three from the corner. I, I was done by then, Jails. I was yeah, done. I was, I, I was hoping that we – my bad, Jay Ellis. No, nah, I mean, it's, it's fine, man. I, I, I was just crazy how he waited so long to attempt to even change the scheme, the defensive scheme. Like, I don't understand why it takes him so long to recognize that something isn't working. It's – Driving me crazy. Go ahead, man. Take over. I'm. Go ahead. I I don't think I, I'm I'm so frustrated. It's not about you know losing, but I've never seen the Knicks team lose by over thirty five points. It's, it's a competing man. It, it's a competing man. And pre- appreciate and have, the call, Q. And they have the nerve. It, it, it's the competing jails. No heart, man. It's a competing. It's not about the W's, man. It's no heart. It's not about the next coach coming in here. And, and and making this team win, it's a, it's it's about the adjustments. Why yeah. are we still seeing the same mistakes? Why yeah. are we seeing a, a, a DSJ Payton tandem in the backcourt like like that is supposed to work? That is ridiculous. Yeah, man, it's 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 it's, it's definitely ridiculous, man. And it, to me, it's not even about missing shots. You know what I mean? Like, I understand you're going to miss shots sometimes, but you have to change the scheme up. You have to play defense. You have to put in the effort. Like you got to show some pride, and there, there is none. Accountability, Q hit on it. Accountability. Randall needs to be held accountable. You know, DSJ needs to be held accountable. Yeah, man. How many times I see DSJ just trot to a three point line? A lot of those wide open corner threes were likely his fault. I'm like, yo, time out. Take him out, man. This is why I get mad, and. And you know what? I'm a I'm a big up I'm a big up Kevin Knox today. I'm bigging up Kevin Knox. Today. Yeah. Kevin Knox had a phenomenal block, came down, shot a three, and that's why you bench players you don't play defense. And I'm, I'm just, people get right. mad. Oh, you get mad. Oh, Jay Ellis, you too hard on Kevin Knox. 
No, this is not daddy daycare, man. This is a man's league. You got to grow up and hold your balls and play and play some defense, man. If, if you're not going to play defense, sit your ass down. That's the way I see it. I'm sorry. That's just the way I see it. And you have to earn your spot. If you're yeah. not going to play defense, sit down. Yeah. Sit down. Kev had a great sequence out there, man. Kev had a great sequence. Blocked two on one. He blocks the shot at the pinnacle, jails at the rim. Yeah. Then comes back in transition, knock down a three. That was the best play of the night before things just completely unraveled. Completely unraveled, man. That's a fact, man. Like, that's what we got to do, man. Yeah. We got we to gotta put it in these guys to play some defense. And I don't know if it's the coach to do it. You might need somebody else. I'm not sure, man. 